open it. Here I have the CIF file for the graphene and WS2. So just drag the CIF file into the... Now here you can see a structure of graphene but it doesn't look like a 2D. So how to make it is 2D? Go to the edit menu. In the edit click on the bond. In the bond here you can see there is a bond. Uh, you can change this number to 2 and click on the search atom bonded to A1 and click on the search additional atoms recursively uh, if either A1 or A2 is visible. Apply. Okay. Now you can see there is three sheets of graphene which are vertically stacked one over other along the C direction. So if you click on the A it look like this. This is the monolayer graphene. If you click on the B, it's along the B direction. If you click on the C, it becomes C. Okay. Now, if suppose I just need only a single sheet of graphene, then what I can do? Select this option, and then select the area which you don't need, and you can just click on the delete. So that will get deleted automatically. You may be thinking that I don't need this boundary. So in that case, you can go to the properties in the properties do not show unit cell do not show just click over here and say okay so now you can see there is no unit cell now if you just move it you can see it's a, it's a 2d material if you graph here okay it's very simple okay. file click on the file and export as a raster image or a vector image i think that's very simple now let's consider example of ws2 so here I have a file for WS2, just drag it over the software. This is the graphene, we are on the WS2. Now you can see again, it looks like a unit cell and doesn't look like a 2D material. So again, go to the edit, bond. Now here we don't see any bond, so you can click on the new. And in this case, maximum length, say three. Again, click on the search atom bonded to A1 and then click on the third option, say apply. Okay. So you can see extended and it looks like a 2D material. So if you click on the A, this is along is a BC plane. If you click on the B, so is the AC plane. If you click on the C, then is the top view. And again, if you just need a single plane, click on this option, select the atom which you don't need and delete, delete them okay now again because i don't need this unit cell so you can go back to the property the property do not show okay that's it so you can see it looks very beautiful